I feel a lens in my head. He's got cowboy boots on. Did you see that? I feel right at home. Here's another reason that you ought to be for Hillary for president. Her spouse travels around in boots he did not buy for the election. These are 20 years old. I want to introduce the gentleman up here with me and ask him to say a word. He is Kendrick Meek, a congressman from Miami, Florida, where Hillary got a majority of the vote in the Democratic primary when there were still a lot of people there. Thanks in part to him, one of the future leaders of the Congress and of our country, and a great friend to us, Congressman Kendrick Meeks. Party. And frankly, the party leaders set this up so they could go in and they knew nobody else would go to these conventions and they could make sure that they had a fair share of the folks that went to the National Convention. It was never intended to basically reverse the results of a popular election in the daytime, but it couldn't happen. So if you're for her, you need to make a note right now and talk to your friends and say, I am not going to lose at night what we win in the daytime in the early voting. We're going to vote twice. Besides, we're going to have parties at all these places. We're going to feed people. And we're going to tell them to laugh. You can vote twice without going to jail. Will you do that?
Yeah. Should I give this back to the uh, guy in the blue shirt? I'm sorry? Should I give this back to the one in the blue shirt? Yeah, yeah this no. guy. My check, my check, probando uno, dos, tres, uno, dos, tres. Mr. President, Mr. President, thank you, thank you, Mr. President. I wish you could do it, Mr. President. Thank you. Mr. President, thank you. Mr. President, thank you. Mr. President, thank you. Sir, will you talk for Univision, sir? Sure. Sir. I got it, sure. In Spanish. In Spanish. No, no. Uh, what else Mrs. Clinton plans to do for the Hispanic community? Do you have any plans for it? Yes, first of all, she supported uh, uh, always and has a part of her education program to do more for Hispanic higher education, mm -hmm. to do more to bring jobs into areas that are predominantly Hispanic, and to have a humane solution to this immigration issue, which will give the undocumented a path to citizenship and which will restore our policy to a pro family policy and stop all this family division. And I think these things are very, very important. And she will attempt very much uh, also to, to empower Hispanics through more opportunities for education. And, and the Hispanic community has the biggest stake at all, of all communities in America, in universal health coverage. Because the, the level of, of uh, uninsured is higher. Also, she has a very aggressive program to reduce the school dropout problem and let more Hispanics stay in school. The Hispanic community has the largest school dropout problem. So you would benefit most from the supports given to young people and their families to help them stay in school and finish. Mrs. Clinton feels that uh, the Hispanic community can help her to get to yes. the White House? Yes, she wouldn't be here without the Hispanic community. Uh, what, uh, she, that's, that's Nevada, New Mexico, Arizona, California, and we hope soon Texas. One more, Thank sir. you. Immigration reform. Yeah. Uh, how does she feel about immigration reform? She supports them. immigration reform with a cooperative relationship with all of our neighbors to improve security, not just on the Rio Grande, but in Canada, all the ports and airports, but also to give the undocumented people here a path to citizenship and to go back to the family unification policies that we used to honor. Now we have a family division policy, which is bad for America. Thank, Thank you, sir. You. Thank you. She also Happy voted for the Dream Act. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I'll bring it right back to you. Thank you. Take a picture with you, Beth. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You are so handsome. Let me take a picture, sir. All right, guys. We gotta go. We gotta go. Did you get it? I got it. Oh, my God. Be careful. Give me your Sharpie. Give me your Sharpie. You have a nice time. No. Thank you. Thank you.